So we're going to talk class acts now, starting with Ansonia and Bloomfield. You know, these guys know each other. They've played before. How do you see this one shaking out? It's, it's, it's at Ansonia to start with. Yeah. I think that's a big advantage for Ansonia, number one. I mean, this is, a, again, this isn't a, a rivalry, but it's a rivalry that they've played in this playoffs six times, and they've both split 3-3. Three, three. Yep. The last time they played was 2015. Uh, a, a game won by uh, by Bloomfield in the state championship game. Uh, this is a really a lot of people did not think Ansoni was going to get back to this point. I mean, they thought they Ansoni would be good, but think of all the guys that they lost last year, and they've yet somehow been able to just you know take on all comers. They beat Nogatuck <laughs> on Thanksgiving, uh, uh, pretty much with a rebuilt team. Uh, they've had a lot of injuries. Uh, they lost two of their top backs to start the season, so they've turned to uh, uh, Shaquem Harmon, who's been great for them. There he is, number two. Yep. Uh, and, and Sheldon Schuler, their their uh, their quarterback. They also have their trademark uh, offensive line and their blitzing defense. So they go into a game against Bluefield, which has so everyone thought Bloomfield was going to get to this point. Yep. It was going to contend for a state championship. So many weapons there, led uh, led by John Butler, their their linebacker slash the running back, a big bruising kid who who's really tough to. Bring. Take down, and he just takes down your, your guys. Uh, so many other weapons there as well. The quarterback Darren Bryden, he's only a sophomore, and they have so many weapons as the receivers, and then they're big up front, and they're really tough on defense. So it uh, should be a really interesting game. And then we go to the other side of it. There you've got Adam Killingworth, Stafford, East Windsor, Summers. That's uh, the other side of that bracket. Yeah, yeah. Two dream seasons from the Pequot Collide. You have Adam Killingworth, 10 wins, 10 and 1. Best season in school history. They have a big line. They have a. a they love to run the ball with Dal uh, Dalton Muldeen and Toby Callender, the quarterback. Um, and then they run up against the Stafford team, which listen, to the, the, just a few years ago, four years ago, before Brian was only got there, he was. Uh, they were 0 and 11, and now look at him now with Colton Angle, Julian Revis, and just so many other playmakers there. Tremendous team. That's going to be another tough one. All right, so Sean Patrick Boley from Game Time CT, in my opinion, they've got the best high school website in the state. Check it out, all that great stuff he and his crew are doing. Sean, thanks for coming in tonight. Thanks a lot.